it's me Sierra aka the nerd girl review and today is kind of just a little catch up so the last time I made a video was for book two a thon which was quite a while ago so there have been no videos and honestly I just didn't feel like making any videos I wasn't in the mood I apologize for all the noise you can hear in the background um yeah, as you can see, I'm in a new setting because um, I moved into my sophomore suite for the school year. So I'm in a different part of campus that's located right by two major hospitals so and a train station and a bus station. So it's going to get quite noisy. I turned off the fan, but I didn't close the window because I don't want to die of heat stroke because I'm on the fifth floor. And as most of you know, heat rises. So, what to say, what to say, what to say, um, I guess I can tell you how my summer went. I did the summer medical program and I went back home as you saw from the book to thon and since then I haven't really done much. I got a lot of reading done though and I'm really proud of myself. I spent so much time reading because I remembered how much I loved to read and now I'm only one book away from my year, my Goodreads, like, yearly goal of reading for uh, 50 books, so I've read 49, I just need one more, and then I'll reach 50. And I honestly didn't think I was going to reach 50 this year because of just how little time I had. But like I thought, in the summer I was able to qu catch up quite a bit. I'm not going to raise my Goodreads goals simply because of I feel happy with the fact that I've accomplished what I've set, so anything over that is just going to feel really extra and like good for me. So I'm going to leave it at 50. Uh, what else? School starts on Monday, so um, I think with how my schedule is, I should be able to read. I don't know. I'm looking for a new job because the job I had no longer exists, which was a bummer to find out. And then, oh, I got a research position, which I'm really happy about that. I'm going to start that soon. And, um... Yeah, so that's kind of how my fall is going to be. Hopefully I'll get a job and I'll be doing research. And then I'm only taking 15 credits as opposed to 18. So that should be better than last year. I don't know. But I'm going to make it a goal of mine to read for at least an hour every night before I go to bed. I feel like that's doable. That I might have to cut that down to like 30 minutes on some days, but we'll see. Um... I'm not going to show you my room because it's quite small. Well, I guess I can show you like my desk area. We got plants and stuff. But it's a single, well, like, this is a suite. So we have like a living room, a kitchen, a bathroom, and then we each have our own room. So this is my room. And it's a bit small, but at least I don't have to share it with anyone, which makes making these videos a lot easier because I can make them without having to worry about like my roommate barging in or anything like that. But as you can see, there is no bookshelf, and I did not bring any books with me. Simply did not have the space. Most of the physical books I own, I've read, and even though I wanted to bring my favorites with me just in case I wanted to reread them, I realized that just wasn't feasible. I do have, you know, my Kindle though, so I will still be reading. I have, you know, library cards and stuff so I can get ebooks on that. And then, you know, I get ARCs and whatnot. Speaking of ARCs, I have one that I got yesterday in the mail. And this is called Wrecked, and it's by Maria Padion. And this is being published by Algonquin Young Readers. And this book comes out October 6th, if I'm not mistaken, and it follows, um, this, this college freshman is sexually assaulted during, like, the beginning of the school year, I believe, and so it kind of follows the aftermath of that, and, like, how her allegations, like, affect her friends, and then how it affects, like, the rapist friends, so I'm really interested in reading this. I can't wait to see how this goes and um yeah I think that's all I have to say I'm planning on pre-recording a couple of book tags but um uh, that's all I have for now until next time